So I've watched this um, relatively old musical. Somehow I had heard of it, but I'd never watched it. And uh, um, it does admittedly have a stupid title. First place, right? So it's stupid uh, song that is known for its namesake. And stuff that happens there is just ridiculous. I mean, who goes around spraying stuff in each other's faces and then only cough after the song finished? I mean, realistically, there is not. People would cough long before the song finishes, surely. But it's 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 something. I mean, I didn't expect much from it at all. I really didn't. But it's it's it sort of you know got better and then a bit better and then it's like a bit better once again. You know. Um, the comedy wasn't too bad either. Honestly, at all, I expected much worse, much more. Obviously, considering that Zac Efron is in it, um, I mean, you know, he's not exactly known to be the most substantial sort of actor. And um, I did watch High School Musical many, many years ago, and you know, it's obviously a shallow thing, really. Don't remember anything substantial whatsoever. But this did have more than that did, didn't it? It's uh, remarkable considering. Well, I mean, they both have uh, stupid titles, I suppose, so it's not like, you know, um, but yeah, for a first stupid title, this doesn't do too badly, I think. I mean, this, this story sort of builds as opposed to something that, that you know, um, I once watched. The Great Gatsby, and you know there was a scene, but I don't know what what the point of the scene was, and it just went by, and nobody ever mentioned it again. It's kind of bizarre when that happens in any movie, and then this one as well. Um, things were tackled, and uh, it was it was interesting how they were tackled, and. Um, as I said, there were a few comedic moments as well, even after doing that, like at the end, when that religious mother just fell off a table, just over a table, so, you know, that's, I don't know, just, I mean, you know, the, the fact that, you know, she thought that her daughter was still dead is because she Played it up. It's it's absolutely irresponsible. Obviously, I honestly don't know if religious people um do that to their children uh, regularly. It should be certainly, surely it should be at least you know um abusive. Uh, it surely it is, but I mean, you know, in terms of uh, legalities, it should be. Uh, so yeah, um, but in terms of a musical, I mean, this this is this works though, doesn't it? I think. Um, yeah, 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 I, um, I did like it more than, uh, than the alternative. It's remarkable, considering, uh, there's a cap in it. I didn't think I'd like anything in it, but, you know. I mean, it's not like he did have a, a, a huge part anyway. And the part he did have, the name he had, Quite strange, I have got to admit. I mean, I haven't played Zelda much, but that's the only link I know, really. I'm assuming since it's been out for 13 years now, because people associate Link with this character as well, unless, you know, considering his character is somewhat minor, and then maybe people don't really remember him much. But. Hmm. 
show I have never heard of anyone else called Link before. That's a strange kind of the video game, I suppose. But anyway, yeah, it's um, I've never heard of any of the other stuff. But no, what am I saying? Um, I knew Kalkin. Yeah, what's he called again? I just cannot believe the. Uh, This was originally written and directed by that guy. Um, I don't know what to think about this guy. I mean, his, his, his other movies don't seem like to be at all like this. And anyway, yeah. Um, yeah, this is the longest. So, uh, no, it wasn't too bad, and uh, it's um, I liked it more than I thought I would, at the very least. It uh, sort of convinced me to like it. I mean, at, at the beginning, one always sort of is it best neutral, I suppose? Cross neutral about movies? Why not? Then, of course, one's opinion changes and you know, whatever happens, happens, and then there's the ending, and then one sees whether the ending is interesting or not, but. Um, it's uh, yeah, it was. It exceeded my expectations. So yeah, I mean, I I I honestly don't know so what exactly is required for a musical to be satisfactory, because you know, musicals are musicals. So uh, they can be hit or miss. And then something like. Phantom of the Opera is obviously so much more grandiose, but uh, that's Phantom of the Opera. I'm not sure there's many others like it. Uh, I, I'd hope at some point to find something like it, but so far I haven't quite. Most musicals seem to be somewhat similar. I mean, yeah, it's just uh, it's one of those things that I don't know why it's all that. Made me think it will be incredibly shallow, but somehow wasn't. Somehow, I mean, it still wasn't as substantial as uh, Phantom of the Opera, I suppose. It's, you know, it's, it's more about, you know, existence and, anyway, yeah, um, and, um, so forth. And, but, uh, oh, this is, this is still, this is more about society at large, I suppose. This made uh, a lot of profits apparently and it cost a lot apparently 75 million what would they have done if it didn't make a profit and uh, even 75 million is quite a lot i'm assuming it's mostly for the props but it did make quite a lot of profits so remarkable um the bomb in 88 the previous version did much less, yeah, apparently. But and it still made profit, but uh, proportionally, uh, it had a way less budget. I mean, yeah, it's 88, so there's inflation then, but I don't suppose 2 million would translate to 75 million, so. Um, oh, 3 million. They nearly 2 million they, they used that to, to make the film in 88. Made between. 8.3 million then. Um, that's uh, close. It's actually it's actually proportionally it's it has been an even better box office actually because the other one had a bit more than half. Mm. And this this seemed to be um, double. Well, yeah, the other one is double, a bit more, a bit 
mother at this one is a bit even more seen that and then, yeah if it was nine million then it would have been nearly or it should have been two times as much as as, as it is anyway but well, yeah. anyway um, yeah. I think it is more in their proportion so yeah and uh, so this should be for the same should be by the same I think uh, yeah new line cinema they produce both the 88 version this is this is not produced and the 2007 version but for a uh, distance isn't it it's uh what's it it's, uh, it's not 18 years isn't it yeah 18 years uh, so you just waited for the um protagonist to grow up <laughs> why not this uh a huge page for it, yeah. Someone's really interested in it. Um, yeah, so so can believe that that guy wrote it. Yeah, never mind about that. Um, he is right away the psychopath, and uh, so yeah, this is his uh, from a moment, Yeah. Ah, uh, Christopher Walken can uh, dance, I guess. Yeah, he can. And so can John Travolta. Yeah, uh, such a hilarious role for him, right? And I can't believe he went from, what was it, like 10 years before at this point? He went from uh, Pulp Fiction, yeah? Getting stupid at down and drugs in there to, um, um, to, um, yeah. He's taking on a uh, fake fat or whatever it is, and uh, where you can. So funny. The length, yeah, honestly, I don't know why. I mean, the, is it just the money that they want or what? Because it seems like a lot, you know, it must be really stuffy underneath it because it seems stuffy. Anyway, uh, whereas the others have it less. I mean, the others will have the best the hair done and such maybe a bit of makeup but not really much more hmm yeah I uh, liked it more than I thought I would pretty much it yeah and uh I don't know if there was a boycott um Okay. Yeah, anyway, um so I'll just read a bit of any rate, maybe I'll just yeah. 